World Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ. I greet you all in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I'm Mrs. Msiza from Nkangala. Uh, on, on the 13th of December, I was among with the people who were prayed for. I was among with the drivers who were prayed for at Pildish. And Pastor asked us to receive. The following week I went to Pretoria with my husband looking for a car. And I found it so I applied. At first they didn't need a deposit. So on the 20, 23 of December, they called me, they told me that they need a deposit. 23 deposit. Since I didn't have a deposit, I went to my bank. I applied. So and I got the money. And it was accepted. Me the was accepted. On the 24th of December, I went to the same dealer. Now I'm going to sign the papers with my governments. But at the bank, they were waiting for my employer to confirm. They tried to call and there was no one who can confirm. On the 24, around 3 o'clock, I went to the same bank in Pretoria. They told me the same story that there's no confirmation. I went to the bathroom. And I talked to my Jesus Christ. And I asked him. To press the button to release that money into my account. Because I already, I already promised the dealers that I'm coming with the money. Then I left. We were moving around with my husband and around 10 past, 10 past 4. And the bank, they are closing at 5 o'clock, and around 10 past 4, I receive an SMS that the money is in my account. And they said, we drive straight to the, to the same bank that is closing at 5 o'clock with my husband. We arrived at 25 to 5. So I gave them the account number so that they can transfer the money to the, to the dealer. So I called the dealers, so we met at a garage. They gave me the key, my car keys. And I thank the Lord Jesus Christ for responding to my prayers. Pastor, I've been blessed with this car. Amen. The challenge that I'm facing now, right, Pastor? What I, if I when, when I have to drive my car, I become nervous and shaking. So I need pray. I ask for prayers, Pastor, today. And also my car is over there, so I ask Pastor to pray for it also. And I like to thank Jesus Christ. Yesterday, what happened? I came here. I was sick. I had stomach cramps since Thursday. So after shaking the pastor's hand with my cut, 
Kamera gaga ile a swara le tsogela muruti ka a swiri karata ya gagwe. So I was healed. A bele ga fodile. I thank you pastor and the Lord Jesus Christ. Ke a go lebe ga muruti ga mmogo le morena Jesus Christ. Thank you. Ke a lebo. World Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Kratalo di medisa ka libitsola Jesu. Amen. I greet you all in the name of Jesus. Eh libitsola ka ke Regina Mogotho wa mo Kalinen. Amen. My name is Regina Mogotho from right here at Kalinen. Eh na ke tlilo le ba mdimi ba salwane. I've come to give thanks to the Lord Christians. For yesterday's service. I had a problem. I had a problem. At my home, I've got a problem. I'm making some bricks. Two weeks back, when I, I came back from work, meanwhile, I was still busy watering them. I fell on top of them. I returned from work at about four o'clock, and at about half past four is when I fell on top of those bricks. Then I recovered at about half past six. When I st stood up there, my, my feet were painful. I took it for granted. They were very hot during the night. I could not sleep. Two days. Then after two days, I was cooking. I was next to the stove and meanwhile I was busy cooking. I fell down all again. What kind of falling is this one? Do you have feet or epilepsy or what? It's what? It becomes like an attack as an asthma. Then you will fall at that place where you are and unable to walk. So when you said you fell right on the bricks, so from past four until six o'clock, were you alone there? No, I was alone. 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 She says she was not alone the day he fell on the bricks. The neighbor was there and is the one who helped her to get back to the house. And then, Toya Mautu, Irahala always hikes and a gojarate, Matuaka Tomo Fisa. This feet problem, it happens sometimes when I enter in my home, my feet start itching. Yesterday, as I was here, as we were praying there, I felt my feet getting hot. As they were calling an altar call for those people who were sick, I came forward. They were very hot, meanwhile, I was busy praying here. From Nagoya, I was at home. From that time, they became better. Some weeks ago, I was asleep. I used to have that attack as I'm using the. Labone le freita ha ke tswale ha bushiu ke papa ma ke rapela ke papa ma ke rapela ka mogo ntse ke tswale ha bushiu sa khono robala. Thursday and Friday, I had those attacks. There were had some blockage. And I would wake up and pray and experience another blockage and I would wake up and pray again. Yesterday when I left here, because the pastor said we should receive fire when we live here going to our homes. Hey pastor, I receive the fire. You must receive it. I want you, Christian, not to take this for granted. When the pastor says receive fire, you must receive it. I saw the fire entering my home yesterday. When I entered at the gate, I didn't expect that 
foot egg any longer. Can I a a I have got a, a, a week with having my foot being painful and I had to take them out of the blankets, but now I could sleep yesterday. Mabani Kirobezi, Azanka Uto Fisa, Motoka Zanka Fisa, until now Kifodi. Yesterday, in the name of Jesus Christ. Kali in Allah Jesu Christ. Keratole Bahamdim. I want to thank God for that. Le Pastor Irene Hutla Morefilu. And for the Pastor Irene for coming here at Refilu. World Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ. Greetings to all in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My name is Magdalene Mungake. Mungake. I'm from Stoven. Yesterday I was here. And I experienced a very terrible cramp. Our pastor Elahanta affects on Tapelayata Maya. After the pastor has prayed for me, it vanished away. Katuhakaya Kohaya Wakan Kaidisha Disha Karobala. I went back home and I seated for a little while and later I went to bed. I'm sure Azanka Grobala even three hours in Nikitara Kitariki Buroko Mara and Zanka Buntara Uyakaeka Papa Maki Papa Misa Hapeki Krempe Molo Tung Lona Len Nikitariki Krempe Mobinwaning. After some few hours, I could not sleep. I had to wake up within three hours. Me Krempe in Chersava Cassestel Lemara, I want to eat in two eight a long con Tecari, Nen Cherimo. That cramp started while I was here studying from my fingers and it went down to my feet. It, was, it seems as if something which was going out of my body. Then I thought in the name of Jesus Christ, that problem which was in my body is running away. That cramp used to attack me sometimes. I would feel it in my stomach as if there are some knots right in my stomach, but I didn't pay much notice to that. Mabani he pasta arapela gukulo karkilu huto leli gima gima fela mosurupi ngamumra. Yesterday, as the pasta was praying, I felt if it was a very big knot on my back. Mara wushiwe ke rubeti gukulo etwa kaminwa na ikuru krempe etwa kaminwa na mauto etwa etwa. But yesterday night, as I was asleep, I felt if that cramp was going away through my so kilebo hajo kilebo hajo fa mudimu. I thank the Lord who sent the pastor here to come and help us, and it's not the first time. The time pastor was at Bronco Spray. I had a, a, a problem with my tooth. I had a toothache. Mara Elisabaka says, Tell us in Cherica Lins, Heki Lolins, a good doctor, Doctor Lenaki Krila to Hila and Potta or Canti, Kinali in Eluri, Arke Bambi Levianica Bolo. It took me some time, but I went to the doctor so that they can t take it out, and the doctor was surprised and said, The way it's so sudden is like a ball. Kalin Ali Nesetelli to Ilekan, Nago Haisabaka says, Three, sat three weeks. She stayed at home for a period of three weeks and bleeding through her mouth. She used to face her side and closing one of her eyes. 
Makotu a ka ha bolela le ngwana ka wa mushimane ba bolela go tlase o ka re ba phunya masenke o ka re nka tsa slepe ka ba re ma melala e ke tswe ka moka moreng ke re ba nthasetsa ba ra wana re bolela go fase ke re no le tla tla masenke My daughter and my daughter in law as they were talking I would be angry with them and saying they are making noise and I would feel that I should kill them and saying they are making noise and they would say no we are not talking aloud but we are just talking normally then the pastor Irene came bronco spray my neighbors invited me to go and attend that outreach Esther pastor was praying and then I became very fine and then I, when I got home I could speak very well and then my children were surprised I was saying can you speak now they said yes because I was attending an outreach at Bronco spread with Pastor Irene So ke leboha Jehova modimo ha ro romela pastor gore a tlo re thusa modimo a mo fematla a mo tlonolo fatse bila mo keletse go feta ka mokwaleng ka hona I'm thankful to God who sent the, his servant to come and help us may the Lord add more and more World Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ Greetings in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Ya ludi mini shabo botle ka nna Jesus Christ wa Nazareth. I slept well pastor. Muruti ke robetse ga botse. And the only I see is there's a pit of fire where things are burning. Se ke se boning ke molete wa mollo mo di lodiswang ka montse. And I when I was sleeping I also dreamed to you it's like you're in my room in our bedroom. Ge be ke robetse ke ile ka lora o ka re re ka mo ka morenya borobalelo. And then you were praying. Oh, Muruti wale kamore nyavro balo ya bona abarapel. I was surprised that pastor is here praying for me. Wila magalora a Muruti show umo wanta pelela. Then M Fakwa could there was a voice coming. Kamera waga ubone linjule lichule lago. That it was saying like someone was speaking to me also. Oba ubonja ukaru umo wale na ba bolela linna. He said this one there were many things. You must not stop to come for this restoration. And uh, after then it was three I wake up and pray. When I was praying, there was like a, a rope, you know, those, those strong that they, they use for cows. And it was cut past the one that was connecting me. It was like it was touched to me and there was another end wording there. And it was being cut. A small, small, small uh, of that rope was left. And I want, so I want to thank Jesus. And I want to encourage someone also. Before then, I want also to tell people that see, I, I've started to see normal menstruation. When? Yes, Pastor, ever since from, from Katang. Were well, you not seeing your menstruation? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Pastor, five years ago when I received Jesus Christ at Pudich, I thought maybe it's because of the operation that time I was not menstruating. I was just eating maybe a few drops, then I'm done. I was just eating maybe a few drops, then I'm done. I was just eating maybe a few drops, then I'm done. I was just eating maybe a few drops, so now I start to see that I, I still have a normal flow. Sometimes I used to think that I'm pregnant because I was, um, uh, I was not uh, using anything. So na I would even skip the month. So I just thought maybe it's the operation that makes things like that. Ah. 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 Do the, those snakes with sucking your blood. Eh, blood. Eh, 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 eh. And to encourage someone who's too bound, 
Even if you come here for prayer, me, I started to come to receive Jesus Christ five years when I gave birth my small child, that one you see, Pastor. I, I never fell down and I, I was confused. I say, Mara, why is this thing troubling me always and I come for prayers? Uh, and sometimes I would do yeah, those things uh, laughing at the back then saying you think that you gonna you gonna win us we were hiding And sometimes I But I followed the the help that they give us when they the counseling you really have to be righteous people of God you really need to be very patient. You really need to take away all the anger. Or someone who was very angry over nothing. But I never give up to come for restoration. And I was now able to control my anger. So it's now five years and these things are starting to fall now. God's time is the best. Don't give up on God, but it's not like mm. So be patient, people of God. Don't go everywhere saying this one, try it tomorrow, that one. Be patient. Lest you make your situation serious. And I want to thank God, because during those troubles we were eating, we never slept without eating. And now, Pastor, we can now communicate well with my husband. We can speak and speak, but we could even just get angry at each other over nothing. I'm still receiving my restoration until the devil is falling down and left me for good. Thank you, Jesus Christ. You are so wonderful. Jesus Christ, thank you. I will never go to my Really, and those spirits, they were saying that yeah, they are men. They cannot go. They cannot live here because there was a covenant, an evil covenant. But look how Jesus Christ is more powerful. Me boy, I will be able to live here. Baba, my way. World Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ.